a visit to Dreamworld that should have been a carefree day. <laughs> Instead, it turned into a nightmare for a Canberra family. Kate Goodchild, her brother Luke, his partner Ruzi Aragi and Sydney mother Cindy Lowe were killed when the popular water ride catastrophically malfunctioned. Kate's daughter Ebony was there and what she witnessed has left her deeply traumatised. She was on the ride with her mother and the two uncles. Saw the whole scene unfold and probably still sees it every day. The accident destroyed a once happy family. She was just so lucky. Those three people loved her a lot. And then she's never going to get that back off. An inquest found a series of safety and maintenance failures at the park had caused the four deaths. It was simply a matter of time. That time came on the 25th of October 2016. It's taken four years from to own that they caused the tragedy. But Ebony's life is still in limbo because her compensation claim remains unresolved. Her family says Ardent is holding out on a payout over a legal technicality that measures the impact of the trauma she has suffered. In a statement to the ABC, the company acknowledges the loss and suffering caused by the accident but says outstanding claims are confidential. Arden's attitude towards Eb is that she hasn't got a claim to answer for because she hasn't opened up to anybody. She keeps it all brought up in herself and holds it all in. They fear forcing her to visit unfamiliar psychiatrists will only make things worse. She won't talk to us, let alone somebody she doesn't know about the accident. So I don't know what they expect from her. Ardent last month pleaded guilty to three charges of failing to comply with health and safety laws. It's facing penalties of more than $4 million. The case will be back in court next month. For Ebony and her family though, okay. there's no end in sight. So what can Ardent do to fix the issue? So I think the best idea is just for Ardent to stop putting us through all the pain that she, and misery and just settle a, settle a case and let her get on with life. Michael Inman, ABC News, Canberra.